to the show, and we have it's Santa. He's our new friend, a little elf. I'm joined by See? Don L. She's yes. uh, the organizer, the owner, rather, of the event. Yes. I want you to tell us what you have new this year well, from previous years. So this year, we're traditionally a home and outdoor living show. But with all the holiday events being canceled, my background is in a holiday show. So I called all my holiday show friends from the past and said, listen, we need to do a half home and outdoor living show, half holiday show. Are you on board? And they said, absolutely, oh, yeah. we'll be there. So we're half and half this year, so you can come get all your home improvement needs taken care of, get some landscaping done, and get your holiday shopping done it's all in one a, place. It's such a great <laughs> opportunity because so many other events have been canceled. Yes. And it's, it's just been horrible. Locally. Yes. Oh, yeah, and 90% of the people who you'll see at our show, whether they're holiday marketplace or landscape contractors, home improvement, they're local. And I don't know about you, but I'm one of those. As soon as Halloween's over, oh. I pull up my Christmas tree. You know tree. what? Halloween doesn't even need to be over. <laughs> <laughs> I have friends who already have their Christmas decorations It's up. 2020. Do so, what makes you happy. Exactly. Right? You have, yes, you have to be mindful of what makes you happy these days. That's for certain. I love all the different items that they have to offer. Yes. For, and it's not just for decor, but as you no, mentioned, no. presents. Yeah, presents. We have clothing, all kinds of gourmet food items, lots of those. And obviously, there's a lot of holidays before Christmas so you can entertain all year round or the rest of the year um, everything you have that we have that you need we have here so it's all it's all good so and lots of handmade handcrafted products and a lot one of a kind yeah and a lot of preparation because yes. we're talking about the health and I know that's probably a concern for some yes to come out, yes what are some of the things that you're doing well when you walk in you have to have a mask on and adjust it as necessary. Yeah. Um, they do, they do a temp check on everybody who comes in. So if you're 100.4, if you're higher than that, you're asked not to, obviously not to enter. We have hand sanitizing stations, every aisle beginning and end, one way aisles, eight foot drape between all the exhibitors. So and it's, we, we have been approved by the health department and we have passed all of their standards. So. And I love how wide the aisles are. It yes. feel crowded. So our now. aisles are normally around 10 feet and so we have 12 foot to 20 foot aisles this oh, year. Yeah. Yes. To help maintain social distancing, obviously. All right. And it started today yes. at 10 a.m. We're up until 8 o'clock tonight, 10 to 8 tomorrow, and 10 to 5 on Sunday. All right. Great. Well, yeah. a great opportunity to head out here to Grand Park. The weather's beautiful. Get it is. Spirit. Yes. Holidays and also just outdoor decor. Yeah. Just, it just to restore some sort of normalcy to our lives, you know? I love that. That's what we're all looking for. Well, thank you so much for speaking to My with pleasure. Us. And I'll go ahead and send back to you guys in the studio. All right, just a reminder here, the uh, Suburban Indy Home and Outdoor Living Fall Show goes until 8 o'clock tonight at Westfield's Grand Park Event Center. It opens up again tomorrow at 10 and goes until 8 and Sunday from 10 to 5. Tickets are $5. They are being sold online only. Kids 12 and under getting free with the ticket. You can also watch more from our home and outdoor living show on our Facebook page following the newscast. Amber will be going live there at about 1230.